I remember specifically um, something that was very special that I remember you came home from and you were just so excited to show me was National Pro Wrestling Day. National Day of Pro Wrestling. Oh my <laughs> gosh. First of all, I didn't even know there was a such thing, but I do believe it was, this was the first time they were mm -hmm. doing it. Mm -hmm. And they had all these people representing all these different companies. I was like, wait a second, why is there not an OBW representative? What? Okay, never mind. We're doing our own thing. Mm -hmm. um, tell me about that. Uh, National Pro Wrestling Day, I really, I didn't know what to expect. Um, while while Chikara was open, there were a few sub companies, uh, basically that were uh, wrestling is. So it was wrestling is it was wrestling is heart, wrestling is respect, wrestling is intense, and they were all over the Midwest, mm -hmm. all over the place. Um, and so a lot of us were representing those companies. Wrestling is, um, and then some other companies um, of the bigger companies around the area. Um, and because it, there was never one before that, I. I had no idea what to expect, mm -hmm. um, so I was I was very I was very excited about it, but I was also very nervous, and I didn't really know what to anticipate from it. Um, and uh, I had to do what I do best. I got the crap kicked out of me. Um, you admitted that after the match was over, I will never forget this. Um, and this is I really do feel like this match in particular because it was in it was in February of last year. Um, really, I feel like it put me on the radar to show the world that I was there, and I was, I was, you know, I was coming because mm -hmm. um, it was there was a lot of there was a lot of focus on it just because it was such a big show, mm -hmm. and there was an afternoon show and an evening show, and it was just so huge. Um, there was, you know, there's quite a few people there, and they, you know, as always, they're always into it, and uh, I got the crap kicked out of me, and you know, the match was over. And I was alone in the ring, and I stood up, and I put my hand in the air, and the entire crowd was on their feet. And I never felt that way before. Like, I was like, oh my god, like, they really genuinely, like, I, I like, they know I can take an ass beating at this point, because it just had two grown men beat the holy crap out of me. But, you know, I still came back up, which is... Which is a lot of what I've tried to to put across with, and you know, I'm 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 the ragdoll for a reason, you know, I I am one of those people I can take a beating, but you know, I'm it's I'm rocky. I will I will come back up. I may I may be days, but I'll, I'm still coming. I'm still coming. You know what I mean? Like, and and it, I really felt like what I had worked so hard to achieve had had been had been put across, and there was so much good reaction out of it, and then. After following after that I started getting a lot more attention as far as the independent scene I was still doing OVW but mm -hmm. as far as the independent scene goes I was I was getting a lot more um, a lot more notice mm -hmm. at that point so mm -hmm. it was it was really a really a big turning point for me in my career mm -hmm. at that point in time